Okay, so this is how you would DJ with using Winamp. So first you want to go, you want to open up Winamp. slow for me, but whatever. Okay. Wow, really slow today. So here you have, you know, your Winamp's open, your Shoutcast DSP plugin. Now, to DJ, where it says address, your the station should have sent you the address to put in. So you would put your address here, your port there. Yeah, I'm just gonna put 8,000 because that's usually the default. But uh, that they would also send you the port and the password. They would normally send you too. I'm just gonna type in something random. Um, go to yellow pages and you can put the description for your website. The you or uh, not the web your website, but uh, your DJ name I would put there. The URL to your website, your aim if you want to, and the genre that you would normally play. Now, you know, you would want to find which setting. I usually use 64. Um, below that is pretty good. 64 is pretty good for me. Now, to talk while DJing, you go to input. It should be on Winamp if it's right. Now, you would go, then you would go to sound card input, and you can either hold this down to talk into the mic which would be the hard way, or you can click lock. Now with it on lock, it'll st keep it locked and you can talk for as long as you want. Then as soon as you're done talking, you just put it back to Winamp and you go and you play a song. That would be how you would DJ. Oh, and I forgot the most important thing. After you enter in everything, you know, you got your settings up, your yellow pages are all together, everything's put in. Click connect. It ain't gonna connect me because it's all fake, but you would click connect. If someone else isn't DJing, it should come up with this. Okay. If you got it all right, when you click connect, this should come up. And then, when you play your song, it should just keep sending bytes. And that would be your How You DJ. This is DJ Do. You're the one and only. Um, not much to say, but have fun. Good luck. <laughs>